Good morning. I am sharing with you my 6 a.m. morning routine. I'm a mom and wife, so it's important for me to start my self-care early in the day so that my mind, body, and spirit are aligned, balanced, and clear. Letting the natural light come through the window is an instant mood booster for my husband and I. It gets us up early and I like to immediately just make the bed. It makes me feel like I've already done something productive for the day and then I can move on and get ready to go out for a jog. Getting your body moving in the morning sets the tone for the day. It jump starts your metabolism, improves your heart health, clears your mind. It's great for your mental health. And I love to start my weekend mornings off like this. During the week, I'll usually work out at night after all my work is done. But there's just something about weekend morning jogs that just make me so happy. Drinking a glass of water in the morning on an empty stomach has helped my stomach issues and my skin. Shower time, it's hair care time with a little help from Function of Beauty. Thank you guys for sponsoring this video. Part of my self-care routine in the mornings is to take care of my hair and nourish it with all the love it can get because it needs it. My hair is very dry. It's color treated, heat styled on a daily basis, and I have leave-in extensions, so it needs a lot of loving hydration. Function of Beauty is completely customizable. You can see my name on the bottle, and I actually picked the color of my shampoo and conditioner and I put my name on it. It is so cute. More importantly, you can customize your hair care. So you take a quiz on the website, you choose your hair type, your hair structure, your scalp moisture, what your hair goals are, and it will give you a customized formula. You can pick the fragrance, the strength of the fragrance. I chose the rose fragrance with the pink color. It's so cute. I've noticed such a difference in my hair, especially because they have clean ingredients, paraben-free, sulfate-free. They're vegan and cruelty-free, which is amazing. So my shampoo and conditioner are going to restore, nourish, and maintain my hair health. And the great thing about the shampoo is it's sulfate-free and it's designed to gently cleanse the hair and maintain a healthy scalp, which I definitely need because I get really dry in my scalp and get flaky and I've definitely seen a difference. I have a link for you guys below so you can check it out. When it comes to my skin, I like to do a resurfacing mask at least one to two times a week. And my body, I have to exfoliate it the same way at least one to two times a week. And here I'm using the Fenty Rough Rider, which is really good. It smells so amazing. And lately I've been using the Bondi Sands Body Wash. It just smells so fresh and just makes me feel like I'm on a tropical island. For a daily light hydration, I'll use this body serum, but today I need a little bit of color, so I am going to be using the Loving Tan Gradual Tan instead. For some reason, this particular Gradual Tan bottle will give you the most beautiful color, even more so than their foam tanners, and it dries super quick and you're ready to go. This is my favorite moisturizer for my face on a daily basis. It's very lightweight and I was going to buy another one, but I just got this one in PR. This is has really, ew. <laughs> if you want bouncy baby soft skin, this is what you need to use. When it comes to SPF for the face, this one is my go-to. It also leaves you with a glowy shine, which I always love. And put this Gucci Guilty Love Edition on and pick my jewelry for the day which are usually gold hoops of some type and this really pretty necklace from Irene Collection and these are my rings for the day.
I'm in the process of getting my closet life together. So I've only done this top part. I still have to get rid of the white hangers. Almost done. So that's why it looks like this. And then it's like a really big mess that I haven't figured out on that side yet. So when I want a quick cute outfit, I'll just grab a set. And I'm going to grab this one today. It's like pants and a little crop top. Very cute, casual, and comfy. So I got my outfit on. I might wear those shoes today. Those are from this. Oh my god, those are from Shoe Dazzle. I kept thinking they were from Miss Lola. I even tagged them in like a photo. Oh my god. But um, okay, so those are from Shoe Dazzle. I'm putting on my comfy shoes right now because I'm going to go get ready. I'm going to do my hair and makeup and let's go upstairs. Before I start anything with my hair, I always put this on. This is the heat spray. After I put the heat spray in my hair, then I'm just going to blow dry everything. Um, especially the roots because I have the K-tip extension, so I have to be like careful on how I, I do my hair. Um, so I really have to blow dry and make sure this part is dry first. So I'm going to do that and then I'll show you what I do next. This is amazing because you can grab like this whole chunk of hair and do it at one time. <clears throat> so it's like quick and easy and it looks like you just got to blow out. I'm going to go ahead and turn it on. Okay, so now that my hair is blow dried, I'm just gonna curl my lashes, put on some brows, and light makeup today. I got this in PR, super exciting. The one size turn up the base BBB cream, and I wanna try it. So I've heard a lot of great things about it. So you open it like that. I've never seen one open up like that. I heard the coverage is really great on this one, so I'm just gonna use that all over the face. And the shade that I'm using is medium 2, medium 2R, which is like rosy undertones. It feels really comfortable. The coverage is definitely there, but I still see my skin, which is nice. And a little bit of cream blush that I had left over. For my lips, I use the Haas Laboratory um, lip liner in Roll. And I just put that on the center all around. And then for the gloss, I use the Buxom Irish Cream all over the lip. Now we're ready to go. Just put on this blue sweater. I get so cold in the morning. I'm gonna go and wake up Jaden so we can make some breakfast. You wanna make some breakfast? Okay, come on, let's go. I don't know why, but I have this habit of just cleaning the counter in the morning. So I'm taking these Lysol wipes and just going over the counter. This is part of my routine, so didn't wanna leave this out. love to tell you guys that I'm an adult and I watch the news in the morning or something but I like to just watch cartoons usually Cartoon Network in the morning um, it's just it's fun it's light and I'm a big kid honestly Jaden wanted pancakes and bacon this morning so we're making that with eggs and I like to have him in the kitchen with me cooking because it's like our bonding time and it's just so fun and sweet to see him learn how to make new foods so this is Jaden's first time making pancakes today and I'm helping Helping him out with that. Luckily, the mixture only required water, so it was super easy. The pancakes do come out a lot flatter, but we typically like thinner pancakes, so it worked out. While that's going, I'll pre-make my iced decaf vanilla coffee. And by the time the food is done, it'll be ready to be made into an iced latte. So this is Caesar's plate. He doesn't really drink coffee, but sometimes he likes to get into the vibe, so I'll make him one. This is an espresso latte. My iced coffee is finally ready. I just frothed almond milk, added cinnamon, and... Picasso! Thank you guys for spending the morning with me, and now we're gonna go out and see where the day takes us. Mm -hmm. 